John Castleman's statue will continue to sit in a city storage yard even after opponents of its removal won at the Kentucky Supreme Court level. A legal technicality short confirmed an effort Monday to have a Louisville judge order the statue put back. Wade News reporter Mark Stevens says Supreme Court opinions take three weeks to become official. Yeah, the Supreme Court ruled on April 27th that the Metro Landmarks Commission had wrongly decided to remove the Castleman statue, but an effort to get the statue put back up 11 days later was stopped for being too soon. Now, we've known supporters of the statue wanted put back onto its pedestal at Cherokee Triangle. It was taken down after it had been vandalized, and John Castleman's history came into dispute. But the Supreme Court agreed with the lawyer challenging its removal that city employees on the Landmarks Commission should not have voted to remove it because they could not be impartial. The city had, had, was asking them to take it down. Now, the Metro lawyer signed this case did not reveal any of the city's cards moving forward at today's hearing. She focused very simply on the time limit that needs to pass first. This motion needs to be um, dismissed because this court actually doesn't have any jurisdiction. Once the order from the Supreme Court becomes final, we'll take it up at that time, and it may be appropriate at that time then to ha uh, have it set for a hearing. Mayor Craig Greenberg told me following the Supreme Court decision he does not want the statue put back up. He said the city was reviewing all of its options moving forward. Now, more of those options will become known once the local judge can actually hear the case that's expected later this month. Mark Stevens, Wave News.